Hello Udemy, I am Shahzad Ahmad from Shakzi.com and uh, welcome in lecture number 2nd. Today we are going to download the admin dashboard and uh, the coding nighter setup and we are going to set up our environment uh, using coding nighter. Make sure we are going to download our coding nighter setup 3.x. Uh, I think the current version of the coding nighter 3.1.7 while I am recording this lecture make sure coding nighter 4 point is not available in this time you can see download and you can see uh, coding nighter 4.x is the um, pre alpha version so this is not available for the production version so I'm going to download the coding nighter 3.1.7 is the current version while I'm recording this lecture so hit the download button so uh, I'm downloading the coding nighter 3.1.7 so we can set up our project. Okay, so now first of all I have installed my XAMPP machine inside my local environment. So uh, you can see I have a XAMPP panel. Hit the button. Okay. So now I'm starting my Apache and uh, MySQL first of all make sure if you are using wham or lamb it's totally depend upon you if you are using wham you can go to your www directory and you can uh, keep these files inside that directory so uh, open so I have just downloaded 3.1.7 coding editor version make sure can uh, cut this project make sure uh, I have installed my XAMPP inside my E drive make sure this is my XAMPP and this is htdocs so I'm saying uh, e-commerce so here is my e-commerce so so this is the folder name so okay paste your coding editor project extract here I'm extracting the coding nighter project make sure before starting this series you have to familiar with coding nighter 3.x so I'm telling you so go if you are not familiar with coding nighter or bootstrap go to your um, Udemy and choose a course I'm also providing coding nighter basics and bootstrap okay so this is your 3.1.7 and uh, you can see go to your local host and type okay first of all rename your okay rename your folder I'm saying this is e-commerce okay now go to your local host I'm saying e-commerce so this is your fresh coding nighter 3.x version okay so now uh, I'm going to set up this so open your editor I have downloaded and I have installed my uh, PHP storm inside my local environment uh, you can see PHP storm if you are using sublime or other text editor it's totally depend upon you okay but in the series I'm going to use PHP storm so okay I'm opening my project where is the project we have just created our e-commerce folder inside docs so you can see here is our e-commerce so open okay so now you can see we have just downloaded our coding nighter setup J just a few seconds uh, it's indexing okay so now you can uh, go to your config folder open your config file first of all make sure uh, we are setting set your first of all set your base URL remove index.php okay why we are doing this uh, because of index.php okay uh, I um, I consider that you have the basic knowledge of the URL structure of coding nighter so uh, set your base URL so this is your base URL you have just removed index.php and make sure I'm going to create the htdocs file in the root okay so here is file I'm saying dot ht access make sure I'm going to create dot ht access file why we are doing 
because go to your uh, documentation and if you can if you have remember so you can see url structure so under the u or coding nighter url okay you can see here is the coding nighter url so copy this bad boy and paste this sections here so now you can access your controllers without index.php so you can see uh, okay so now go to your application and uh, config routes and you can see here is your welcome controller which is coming okay here is your welcome controller i'm going to i'm creating the home controller make sure first letter is capital home controller and uh, i'm going to keep this file inside the code controller sections okay i have just created the home controller i'm saying extends to ci make sure controller ci underscore controller okay and i'm going to create the index method so we can access okay i'm saying working i have just created home controllers make sure go to your routes i'm saying home is the default controller of my website uh, now you can refresh your page you can see here is the working environment so we have just created our home controller and uh, we have created index.php file you can see you can access home without adding index.php and then home so this is the basic url structure and uh, i consider that you have the basic knowledge of coding nighter okay so now i'm going to download a dashboard um, for admin panel because we are going to create dashboard for admin so your admin your website admin or your shop owner can manage your store from that admin panel so i'm saying dashboard free dashboard dashboard in bootstrap okay you can see you have some results so you can open first result so okay then second third fourth okay so now you can see i'm going to download this template for our admin panel make sure why we are downloading the html template because it's hard to create each and everything from scratch so that's why i'm downloading this template hit the download button you can see uh, okay 4.2 okay i'm going to download source zip code so you can see i'm downloading admin lte 2.4.2 okay 2.4.2 is the current version of admin lte dashboard make sure the name of the dashboard is admin lte okay so now okay it's downloading okay i have a internet issue just a second okay we have successfully downloaded the admin lte 2.4.2 version this is the admin dashboard so um, where you can keep this this file cut this file make sure i have installed my server inside my e directory and here is your server okay so now you can see i have a ht docs where is the ht docs i'm saying this is the ht docs and uh, if you remember we have a e-commerce folders and now i'm going to create the assets folder assets folder new folder new directory assets okay so you can see we have just created the assets folder double click on on the folder and extract your files okay 
so now we are extracting the admin dashboard which we have just downloaded so don't worry it's a free version of um, dashboards okay it, it's successfully extracted so we have successfully extracted our dashboard so uh, we have successfully download our coding editor setup make sure first of all we have downloaded our admin dashboard and uh, from the Google and make sure we are going to download coding nighter oh sorry bootstrap 3 okay bootstrap 3 okay you can see you can download 3.3 point or oh, you can see 3.3.7 make sure we are not going to use bootstrap 4 we are going to use bootstrap 3 because we have downloaded the template the admin this template dashboard which we have just downloaded um, this is the uh, bootstrap 3.x version and we have downloaded a template which is also which is also bootstrap 3.x okay so uh, in the next lecture we are going to break our html content into multiple views and i will teach you why we are breaking our html content into multiple views and we are going to set up our admin panel so we can uh, so you can add your um, product or categories so we will uh, okay so don't worry we are going to cover each and everything each and every basics um, e-commerce basics in this series so thank you for watching